Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome back to Lords of the Fallen. So last time we made our way to the graveyard and took on our third boss of the game, the Worshipper. And I found an NPC over here. Hello. Good. You've made it this far. I was worried, but I guess the Scythe just couldn't keep up with you. Wait a minute. This is Caslow. Oh, okay, I guess we found him. I've faced worse. I've faced worse. Well, well, well. Look what the cat dragged in. Oh, it's you. Caslow. Meet Yetka. She's looking for whatever she's trying to find. You don't know the half of it, Harkin. I can see you've picked up a monk. The last one I met, I dumped. Charming. You know how to break ice in conversation, don't you? Ha 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 ha. I guess let's just jump straight to the point. Caslow, are you ready? Caslow, are you ready to open the pathway? As you might suspect, matters are a touch more complicated than I thought. Too bad you don't have the room combination to open it. Let me guess. You know what it is. I have the combination here in my book of lineage. We need to find someone that can wield magic. That would be Kazlo. Allow me. Well, ain't that a happy coincidence? So, can I give you your dagger now? I... I don't know. Okay, well anyway, I saw some booty over here in the cutscene, so let's grab that very quickly. Give it to me. Oh, we got another human skull. Still don't know what the hell we do with them, but hey, at least we found it. Did I just see an enemy over here? I... okay, I guess I imagine that. I could have sworn I saw an archer in that gate. Oh, no, I did. Okay. Hello, buddy. We got defiance, a hammer, and a steel dagger, and something else as well. I wasn't really paying that much attention. Alright, let's check this shit out very quickly. Okay, we can't wield that. And the dagger, probably crappy, so... Whatever. Hello? Dude. Oh, shit. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, I know where we are. We're at the bottom of the, uh, the cliff where these two guys mauled the crap out of me last episode. So, we took, like, an alternate route? Interesting. I wonder if the worship is optional. It kind of seems like it might be, because surely you could entirely bypass the graveyard. By going down here past these guys. I don't really know. But yeah, we do kind of need to backtrack because there's some stuff we're missing and there was that door that I don't think we ever actually checked. Or maybe... I, I, I genuinely don't remember. I don't think we checked the door. This guy is still kind of kicking the crap out of me. There we go. Okay, just two hand to mash the crap out of them. Seems like a good way to deal with them. But yeah, like I mentioned, there was a door over here. I know we went up the tower. But I... Oh! Okay, and this is open now. Well... This is probably going to get me killed, but screw it. Free booty. Well, probably not free. Ooh. Oh, we're in the Proving Grounds. Okay, so it's like uh, an arena. Well, this is going to suck. Get ready. Oh, I'm ready. Let's do this shit. Oh. Oh, that's like uh, a checkpoint thing over there. Properly really should have used that, but... Better leave for that now, I guess. Hello? One of the shield bastards. Alright, try to take care of the big guy, because even though he's got more HP, he's also more dangerous, more agile, and somewhat more squishy, just because I can actually hit him. He doesn't have a shield. Plus, you know, accidental backstab of justice. Die! <laughs> I will forever love that attack. Oh, you dick. It's like he knew. Oh, by the way, I forgot to mention, you can see I'm wearing the uh, lion-ish, I think it's called the courage armor. It's actually got less defense than the medium armor we were wearing. I don't think it looks as cool. It does still look pretty damn cool, though. But uh, the reason I'm wearing it is just because it has more poise. I don't know. I just felt like changing armor, so we're just going to roll with this for now. If we start sucking balls... Uh, oh, the checkpoint came back. Oh, interesting. But yeah, if we start sucking balls in this, we can always switch back. It's not really going to be a huge deal, but... I don't know. I just felt like mixing it up. Hello, buddy. These dudes shouldn't be too tough. However, this archer... Complete bastard. There's a flaily arm man over there as well. Let's get a flaily... Just, just leave me alone. My god. Oh, we two shine now. Nice. What the hell are you doing, sir? What the hell are you doing? Kicking the crap out of me. That's what you're doing. I don't know if we should be using that checkpoints. I'm wondering if it just checkpoints you here, so if you die, you spawn here. Or maybe actually it's like a, a way of saving what wave you're on. I doubt it. Oh no, we'll mess around with that later when we need to. But uh, I know there's like a limit on how often you can restore your Estus thingies. So we'll try and do that when we're running out. 
Evening, sir. I, we haven't actually fought one of these dudes yet, have we? And, uh, they seem very, very quick and very tanky. How do we get him to... Oh, shit. How do we get the shield down? Oh, damn. Okay, that, like, flat out stuns me. Don't get hit by that. Oh, you son of a bitch. Okay, you do a lot of damage. Like, a lot of damage. I need to heal. Okay. So, how do we deal with this guy? I... I don't know. Like, I really don't know. Um... Buddy, I need to... I just, this is bad. How the hell do we get the shield down? I... Oh! Damn! You just did two-thirds of my HP with that attack! Oh, shit. Okay, so these dudes are not to be messed with. So this might be the final wave? I don't really know, but, uh... This dude is like a boss on his own. I'm trying to get around behind you. Oh, I hate you. Well, that's bad. Move! Okay. Uh... I... I straight up don't know what to do here. He's gonna kill me. This is, uh... This is really shitty. And yeah, the, the checkpoint's down. So you can't use it during battle. I swear it was up before last time, I don't really know. Maybe I imagined that. Oh, shit. We're gonna die. Like, like it's gonna happen. Unless by some miracle I figure out how to get this guy's shield down. There's gotta be a way. Because it's like really freaking hard to get around behind him. How do I do it? I mean, I guess we could try the claw, but... I don't know how effective that's gonna be. I really don't know what to do here. I mean, I guess maybe we kind of have to parry him. I don't know. Let's try the claw. I, well, I did so I'm dead. Damn. Holy shit. Okay, so we need to figure out how to deal with that guy. Otherwise, he's just going to kill me again. There's got to be something I'm missing. Okay, we're back on this godforsaken wave again. Now, this time, let's actually see if we can deal with this guy a little bit better. We have all of our drinky things. We're full HP. So, yeah. Oh, shit. Basically, you do want to use the checkpoint between the bonfire, whatever the hell. Why is it up now? That was definitely down last time I was finding him. Is that a bug? I don't know. But, yeah, you definitely want to use it as much as you can because it fully restores your HP. I think there's a time limit on that. So, I don't think we can just spam it, even though it's staying up during this fight. Although, maybe we can. I don't really know, but... Yeah, essentially, we need to do much better this time than we did before. I mean, we kind of have the added benefit that that checkpoint doesn't seem to be going down now. Which I still think must be a bug. Because it was definitely down last time. It was either a bug that was down last time, or it's a bug that's down this time. Makes more sense to me that it's just not supposed to be up whilst you're fighting, though, so... I'm still gonna take advantage of it. Screw that shit. Okay, it did work. So, maybe it doesn't have a cooldown, I don't know, but... Yeah, the crap core actually seems pretty good on this guy, because it doesn't seem to matter when he uses his shield. No shit! I was hoping the checkpoint was gonna restore my magic, because then I could just crap claw the crap out of him, because... Yeah, oh god, the shield doesn't seem to do anything against that. Okay, this is going much better. I think we can actually be in this time. Just gotta make sure we're careful and keep our HP high, because... <laughs> exactly! Because that does a shit ton of damage. Like, good lord. No, 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 no. That's a very bad Rogar. Kill me a body. Okay, that's... that's not good. I can't need to... Okay, we almost got him. We might be out of crab glory. We might not even need it. I got... Yes! Oh, we completed it. Oh, thank you. Holy shit. That... I... There must be a better way of dealing with those guys. But right now, I have no idea what it is. Either way, we won. We'll try and figure out next time we fight them. Okay, what do we get? If I can... Hello? Can I click you? Oh, there we go. Okay, so we got some random junk and a ring called Bankbreaker. Okay, what do you do? Ah, interesting. So it sounds like that either... Yeah, it sounds like probably allows us to move better in heavier gear, which... Kind of freaking ideal. Wait, why did the checkpoint go down then? It wasn't down during the fight. That's weird. <laughs> I don't know what up with that. Right, well, anyway, we're done here. Let's get the crap out of here. If I can... Oh, there we go. What the hell is going on with the prompts today? It's like, it's like really screwing up. Any time, load screen. Any time. Hello? Did I break the game? What the hell? Okay, that was... 
That was weird. Oh, by the way, I've heard a lot of reports that people have had this game crashing on them, like, constantly, especially on the PC, even on the PlayStation 4, apparently. I don't know about the Xbox One, but... Yeah, personally, I haven't had any crashes so far, but just be aware, once again, if you are buying this, or thinking about buying this, from what I've been told, a lot of people have had crashes constantly. It might just be that they're playing the game for long periods of time, because usually, when you see a video, that's how long I've played the game. I either take a break and go play a different game, or... It's rare that I play a game for more than an hour, maybe two at a time, so... Yeah, I don't really know. Anyway, I'm gonna do some backtracking very quickly, see if we missed anything, and then we'll carry on. Okay, so we're back here again. You may remember this place. We ran along here when I died once, and I didn't know which direction I went in, and it turned out we hadn't gone this way. And there's three of these giant fellas over here. So, suffice to say... Probably gonna go kind of poorly, but I think we kill one, so logic says we can keep killing them. And yeah, the crap floor does seem to be a good way to go. Where you get out of here? So we gotta try going in this direction, see what's down here, but I fully expect to die. Let me just disclaim that right now. One of them killed me, and then we really struggled to finish off, you know, his brethren after we died. So I don't foresee this going well against three of the dudes, plus there was some- Oh, good lord, I'm nearly dead. Plus there were some archers over there and shit, so... Yeah, it's, uh, it's kinda dangerous, and the checkpoint's down. Well, fan bloody tastic Buddy, leave me alone, I need to heal. Okay, drink that shit. Hey, the checkpoint's back up. Okay, so it seemed like the proximity of the enemies to the check- Oh, really? Come on, man. The proximity of the enemies to the checkpoint depends whether or not it's up. So that might have been why it was up during that fight. Maybe I just lured him far enough away? It's kind of hard to say, I don't know. But yeah, I mean, the sword seems fairly effective against this guy, because that's the thing about the staff is, because it does a lot less damage, the opportunities you do get to hit him don't do that much. Whereas one good swing with this counts for a few, so... Yeah, I know, slow weapons, they certainly do have advantages, but... Yeah, oh, shit. Oh, I'm gonna die. Okay. Gonna, just gonna chug on that shit. Okay, get away from me, buddy. Oh, son. Damn, that felt good. Ain't dropped me nothing. You free loan son of a bitch. Now, I don't think clicking a checkpoint makes enemies respawn. Certainly doesn't seem to. He might be considered a mini boss. I don't really know. I kind of hope so. But yeah, I mean, I want to see what's down here, because if there's three of those big dudes, you would think they're going to be guarding something good. So there's probably going to be some kind of amazing booty down here. So, oh shit. Oh, buddy. How's it going? Wait, what? Why'd you have so much HP? Uh. This sword does a lot of damage, and we like three shot them with a the stuff. What the hell? Is this a tougher version? Surely it's gotta be. Like, he is taking so many damn hits. That's insane. Okay. Interesting. So it seems like there's tougher enemies down here. That's bad. That's really bad combined with the big fellas. Oh, hey, we got uh, some more booty, and we have to use a rune on it again. I would say it's probably a worthy cause. Please give me another Restus or something. Hey, we totally got one, sweet. And we also got an axe called a Guard's Axe or something? Hey, I think that's what it said. Oh, a Guardman. Well, whatever, same damn thing, kind of. And once again, we can't wield it. It seems to be a strength weapon, so frankly, screw that shit. Oh, well, hello. Now, are you weak? Now, oh... Okay, that one seemed to be regular, but we just got firebombed by someone. I, I don't know who that was. Was it you? I don't know, but we need... Yeah, this archer seems tougher as well. This is not good, man. This is like really... Really bad? Okay, you, sir, need to die. Thank you. Now, I believe there was two big fellas... Right around here. We need to get rid of you as well. Oh, shit. Okay, oh... What? He just messed me up. Son of a bitch, man! Okay, so yeah, that's definitely a tougher version of the Flame the Arm, man. That's not good. Like, I... I had no idea he was gonna do that much damage. That sucked. But hey, look on the bright side, I don't see the big fella. So, it looks like maybe he was a miniboss. Anyway, give me a second here to switch back to the Live Elements armor, because once again, it's got more defense, and frankly, it just looks cooler. So yeah. <laughs> Screw the heavy shit for now. Okay, that's better. Let's do this. Now... What? Oh shit, he's back. You have got to be kidding me. I really don't want to fight him again. He took so long last time. Let me just, just grab my bloodstain and we'll, uh... Oh shit! Oh, oh god, I'm on fire! 
<laughs> I don't want to do. I want to see what's down here, but I really don't want to kill those big fellas. Like, they are way too tough right now. Or at least I don't know what we're supposed to. Oh, good lord. I don't know what the tactic is. Again, maybe you're supposed to parry them, I don't know, but there's a door over here. Oh, it's locked. This. But apparently, a magical barrier. I don't see any booty around here, so. It looks like we're not supposed to come here yet, is kind of what I'm getting from this cell. Frankly, I think we should just leave. Screw this shit. See ya, jerks. Please don't drive by me on the way past. I don't want to die. Okay, but... <laughs> you drive by me. Okay, we're alive. Oh, oh, good lord, we're on fire. Drink. Run. Just run. Okay, I think we... Okay, maybe we're not going to be fine. Just go. 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 Okay. We're alive. We're not on fire anymore. Anyway, give me a moment here to get back to Castle Owen Kef Yetka? Yetka? Was that it? Do I remember the name? I'm shocked by this. I wanted to say Kefka. But I think Kefka's ouch! I think Kefka's a guy from Final Fantasy VI or something. I don't remember, but so yeah, anyway, give me a moment here to get back there and we'll carry on. Okay, we're back, and I probably really should have killed these enemies because I kinda died. You did leave me in the checkpoints! Son of a bitch! <laughs> oh, fuck everything. Okay, sometime later I cleared the path of all the goddamn enemies besides this guy who, you know, not really a problem. Now, can I please touch the freaking checkpoint? I just saw another uh, one of those challenge gate thingies over there, so... That one doesn't seem to be open yet, either. Unless we went in there, but I don't think we did. Anyway, so we can get a... I think two, maybe three stat upgrades here. I guess at this point, we will probably start going into agility so that we can wield the Kamar Staff. Or whatever the hell it's called. Again, it might be shitty, I don't really know, but... Yeah, it's kind of what I'm leaning towards. I don't know, I'm gonna go over the weapons here quickly, kind of decide what we're going with, but... Probably gonna be agility. Man, you know what, fuck it, I don't really want to look at every single weapon for 20 minutes, so let's just go with the staff, so. Let's get our stand upgrades. I wish you could just click a button to put, like, an entire point into this instead of doing it, like, you know, charging the bar every time. I don't know, it just seems a little bit unnecessarily slow to me, but whatever. Okay, so one more agility level, and we can use a new stuff. God, that excites me, you have no idea. Okay, can we go in here? Yes, we can. Okay, so, I assume this is the pathway that they mentioned? So I guess this is going to be extremely important. Maybe. I can't believe it. It's not a chamber. It's a whole other world. It looks familiar, but like a child's memory. It's twisted, broken. That ray of light, is this the device you're looking for? I won't go with you. You'll only slow me down. Well, see you around, big head. Maybe. Big head? How dare you? Oh, and she's gone. Damn, I was gonna give you a ding. I suppose I should have spoke to her outside, but... I know we were gonna apparently venture into a new world and, uh, you know, have her abandon us. Okay, so this looks very, very cool so far. I was gonna say, like, don't get me wrong, I love the game so far, but it's about time we had to change the scenery because we've been running around towers in the same area for quite some time. Admittedly, I probably could have done that a lot quicker, but, you know... The search for booty was very important, and I'm still bound to have missed a shit ton of it. There's still some quests back there that we haven't done yet, like we still need to find the other two, uh... Glyph marking thingies for that one dude who looked like a dragon priest... ...back in the Citadel or wherever the hell he was. So yeah, don't know what up with that, and who the hell are you? Are you friendly? Yes. He took his leaden sword in hand. You can speak. As can you. Imagine my surprise. Yes, he's a crafter. What the hell are you? What are you? I don't know. I do not abide the mortal laws. I left the realm of men a hundred lifetimes ago. I do not have a name. I don't remember it. And it does not matter here. You left the realm of men? From the moment the universes were born, they began to die. It's inevitable. Nothing stays the same. Even you are changing in this moment, right in front of me, and I in front of you. I like his hair, it's trippy. So what are you doing here? 
What are you doing here? Something is searching for me. Something of high value. It will arrive by and by. What do you mean? It will come when the Rogar go. The Rogar are not leaving any time soon. Coming and going and coming. It makes no difference to me. What is this precious thing you seek? It is a crystal, a very special crystal. A crystal that can rend a tear between the realms. A tear powerful enough to distort other ruptures. The Rogar could be using that crystal to enter our world. You will find the crystal itself in the place of power. A place where all energy gathers. Take it away, and the Rogar Lords will travel no more. Then, bring it back to me. Yes. I am so confused right now. Okay, so are you a smith? These tools... Are you a smithy of some sort? In some ways, yes. You could say so. Bingo! I do have dealings with weapons and the like. Craft something for me. You ask me for a glass of water, and I could give you the ocean. Give me the ocean, then. Show me one of your runes, and with this rune, you can imbue any weapon you like. Oh, diggity, it's about damn time. Okay, so we can finally... <coughs> wow, <coughs> good work, voice. Okay, so we can finally use those runes that we got a long last time ago. Interesting. So, it sounds like we can... use experience to have a higher chance of getting a better rune? I don't know how I feel about that. I mean, it's interesting, but I don't really want to use my experience on that, because I don't want to get the stat upgrade so we can use new stuff, and... Start investing some into uh, the magic abilities so we can actually use that stuff. So yeah. I don't know, I guess for now, if I can actually... How the hell do I do this? I'm pressing the button, it's not working. Hello? What do you want from me, game? I don't know. I... What the hell do I press? I'm pressing R1, it's not doing anything. Oh, there we go, okay, whatever. Right, so yeah, I think for now, we'll just crack open the runes we have, and then maybe a bit later on in the game, when we actually have some EXP to burn, if it ever happens, we'll start investing some to try and get better runes. If that is indeed what's going on with this, I think it is, but it's a little tiny bit confusing. Okay, so we got some decent looking shit there by the looks of things. So he said we can put it on any weapon. Now, obviously, it's tempting to put it on the stuff. However, one agility level, and we're probably going to be using a new stuff, unless it sucks. So, I guess for now, we'll just hold on to them. And then we'll get that agility level, we'll see what the stuff is like. If we like it, then we'll check our best rune on that. We're bound to get another good rune at some point very soon after, so if we upgrade to a different weapon, we'll have it at that point. So I guess that's what we do for now. But yeah, it's very cool nonetheless, and it's about damn time that we can actually use our runes. And is it just me, or does this game... Hey, we got the checkpoints. This game really reminds me of Darksiders, but with like, you know, Dark Souls mechanics. Anyway... I'm going to end it here. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, I would appreciate it. A like, and I'll see you next time for more Lords of the Fallen.